Tonight is the first night of Hanukkah and the beginning of an eight-day celebration deeply rooted in Jewish tradition. 22 News reporter Christina DeMores joins us live in studio after attending a special observance in Springfield. I was at the annual menorah lighting in downtown Springfield and people there are telling me the light is a symbol of resilience and hope, especially now with so much uncertainty taking place in the Middle East. A menorah illuminating Court Square in downtown Springfield as people of the Jewish faith gather to observe the first night of Hanukkah. The over 2,000-year-old Jewish holiday historically recognizes the recovery of Jerusalem and the rededication of what is known as Herod's Temple. And it is celebrated with the nightly menorah lighting for the next eight days. And that way we carry the theme that a little light dispels much darkness. It represents the divine light. And finding that light in the darkness continues to be the message during Hanukkah as the unrest continues overseas in Israel. People here remembering the victims killed during the Hamas attack and sending the miracle of the light to those who are still being held hostage. Our hearts are with people of Israel and the people um, in the Middle East as well. We so hope that things will change, that the light and maybe the despair we're all feeling now, the situation in Israel in the Middle least that this could be the beginning of maybe something be settled or a breakthrough. Local leaders also echoing that hope, showing their continued support for the Jewish community. Things have been darkened right now, uh, but Israel will continue to stand strong and we stand in solidarity and the light will continue to shine. More Hanukkah celebrations will be held here in Western Massachusetts over the next few days, and you can get the details on that on our website, wwlp.com. Working for you tonight, Christina DeMores, 22 News.